In 1977, NASA launched Voyager 1, which remains the most distant human-made object ever built. Despite its achievement, Voyager would need nearly 28,000 years to reach another star system. Recently, astronomers observed an interstellar object called 3I Atlas, which is naturally moving through the galaxy at much higher speed. Astrophysicist Avi Loeb has highlighted how such objects can traverse interstellar distances far faster than our spacecraft, raising important questions about how we explore beyond our solar system. In this video, we will examine what 3I Atlas is, why its speed matters, and what it means for future interstellar exploration. Let's get started. Voyager 1 represents one of the most ambitious space missions ever attempted. After its launch in 1977, it used gravity assist from Jupiter and Saturn to reach a speed of about 17 kilometers per second relative to the Sun. That velocity was sufficient to escape the solar system, allowing Voyager to enter interstellar space and continue operating decades beyond its original mission. However, Voyager's trajectory was never intended to reach another star. Even if it were precisely aimed, calculations show that it would take roughly 28,000 years to reach the nearest stellar systems. This outcome reflects the limitations of chemical propulsion and mission design, not a shortcoming of engineering. 3I Atlas presents a very different case. It is an interstellar object on a hyperbolic orbit, meaning it originated outside the solar system and will eventually leave it permanently. It is only the third confirmed interstellar object ever detected, following 1I Oumuamua and 2I Borisov. Unlike those earlier discoveries, 3I Atlas shows clear cometary behavior, including outgassing and dust emission as it warms near the sun. Measurements indicate that 3I Atlas is traveling significantly faster than Voyager. Its speed was not achieved through propulsion or planning, but through gravitational interactions in another planetary system, followed by long-term motion through the Milky Way. These processes naturally generate velocities that exceed those of human-made spacecraft. Avi Loeb drew attention to this contrast by comparing travel times between stars. His estimate suggests that an object like 3I Atlas could traverse interstellar distances in around 8,000 years, several times faster than Voyager, simply because it began its journey with a much higher velocity. The discovery of 3I Atlas is therefore significant not because it is unusual in isolation, but because it illustrates how common galactic processes produce speeds far beyond those achievable with current spacecraft technology. The primary scientific value of 3II Atlas lies in its origin. This object formed around another star and carries material that reflects the conditions of a different planetary system. As it passes through our solar neighborhood, it offers a rare opportunity to study extrasolar material directly rather than through remote observation. By analyzing the gases and dust released as the comet heats up, scientists can compare its chemical composition with that of comets formed around the sun these comparisons help test theories of planetary formation and determine how similar or different other planetary systems may be from our own. Even small variations can reveal how temperature, radiation, and stellar environment influence planetary building blocks. Loeb's broader argument focuses on dynamics rather than composition. He emphasizes that interstellar objects are shaped by long-term gravitational interactions involving stars and planets. During planetary system formation, close encounters and instabilities frequently eject material into interstellar space. Once expelled, these objects continue moving through the galaxy, preserving the velocities imparted to them at the time of ejection. From this perspective, the speed of 3I Atlas is not exceptional but expected. Voyager, by contrast, was designed for controlled exploration, reliability, and communication. Its speed reflects engineering constraints and mission priorities rather than the limits of physics. 
Loeb has suggested that future missions could attempt to intercept interstellar objects. Even a brief flyby could yield data that would otherwise require spacecraft traveling for centuries. More speculative ideas include attaching instruments or data packages to such objects, allowing them to act as long-term carriers through the galaxy. While these concepts are not currently feasible, they highlight how interstellar visitors could expand scientific reach without waiting for revolutionary propulsion systems. It is important to note that current observations of 3I Atlas are consistent with a natural comet. There is no verified evidence of artificial origin or unknown physics. The scientific focus remains on careful observation, improved modeling, and refining classification methods for future discoveries. Rather than introducing controversy, 3I Atlas provides a new framework for thinking about how matter moves between stars and how interstellar science can be conducted using naturally occurring objects. The comparison between Voyager and 3I Atlas has broader implications for space exploration. It highlights the gap between human-made propulsion systems and the velocities generated by galactic dynamics. Addressing this gap will require either major technological advances or alternative mission concepts that leverage natural forces more effectively. In the near term, interstellar objects represent observational opportunities rather than transportation solutions. 3I Atlas passed through the inner solar system in late 2025 and is expected to travel near Jupiter's region in 2026. These encounters allow astronomers to study how interstellar objects interact with solar radiation, planetary gravity, and magnetic environments. Future sky surveys are expected to detect many more interstellar visitors. As detection rates increase, scientists will be able to estimate how common such objects are and how frequently material is exchanged between star systems. This information is essential for understanding galactic evolution and the distribution of planetary material across the Milky Way. There are also implications for mission planning. Instead of designing spacecraft that must independently achieve interstellar speeds, researchers may explore interception missions or gravity-assisted trajectories that exploit naturally fast-moving objects. While such concepts remain theoretical, they represent a shift in how interstellar exploration is approached. On a conceptual level, these discoveries alter the narrative of exploration. Voyager represents deliberate, carefully planned exploration that unfolds over long timescales. Interstellar objects represent unplanned exploration, driven by natural processes operating over millions of years. Both contribute to scientific understanding, but they do so in fundamentally different ways. Loeb's idea of interstellar archaeology reflects this shift. The goal is not to search for technology, but to reconstruct the history of the galaxy by studying objects that have traveled between stars. Each interstellar visitor provides a snapshot of environments that are otherwise inaccessible. As observational capabilities improve, interstellar science is likely to become a more regular field of study rather than a series of rare events. The main challenge will be extracting meaningful data during brief encounters and interpreting it within a broader galactic context. Voyager shows how far human engineering can go, but also how slow interstellar travel remains. Objects like 3I Atlas reveal that nature routinely moves material between stars far more efficiently. Studying these visitors may reshape how interstellar exploration is understood and pursued.